welcome back to my channel I just woke up at 7 a.m today is sunday the 18th of july and i'm gonna take you guys along with me to royal holloway university in egham so at the moment it is 7 30 um so i just woke up half an hour ago i did some meditation tidied up my room um i hope you guys are having a lovely day so obviously i'm not gonna leave the house looking like this i'm going to get ready i'm gonna make myself breakfast i booked a train ticket from london waterloo and i am excited but just to update you guys two days ago i went to paddington Holland Park and goes into like a nice London day out trip and I'm going to be posting a blog about that which is exciting. I was going to start it off yesterday. I was tired from walking under the heat. It's been quite hot and sunny. If this is your first time watching this, I post lifestyle, beauty and personal content. Hit the subscribe button down below, especially if you like my content and if you want to see more. I've got some exciting content coming up including a fashion lookbook but i'm also going to include some footage that i have filmed on friday i didn't intend to vlog on that day i will insert some footage here chill i didn't go out that much i had to go to my local asda to return something that i've ordered from plt as it was the wrong size it was too small i just realized that i'm a size 10 comment down below if you can relate to that notion of when you do your online fashion shopping and you order the wrong size and you have to return it but it's fine i got that done and out of the way so i reordered going to keep my vlogs positive I realised that I have no lashes left, they lasted a pretty decent long time but can I just say how different I look without the lashes, like really does make a difference to my face and I will be getting them again but I'm just giving my lashes, my natural lashes a break, they made my eyes look bigger, I don't really have a set plan of what exactly I'm going to be doing, I'm going to be spontaneous being a bit spontaneous is good. I might have lunch, I really don't know what I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna walk around, I'm gonna show you guys the university. Also, I visited this university once before, last year with my family, but now, you know, taking myself out, doing my self-care, I will keep you guys updated. Hi guys, I'm in the kitchen, so I'm just gonna show you guys what I have for breakfast. Bear in mind, I don't have the same thing for breakfast, like, but normally my go-tos are avocado, guacamole, iced milk coffee if the weather is hot. I have pineapple water, we ran out of lemon, so don't have water, and toast with smoked olive oil and honey. So I'm going to eat this whilst I talk to you guys. Okay, I'm just setting this up. But I, I think I look better than the previous footage. This vlog has more of a personal touch to it. I am chatting to you guys. I just wanted to say, so next week, me and a few friends, we're planning to go to the club. As you know, clubs are opening on the 19th of July. Then one of my friends can come due to something else going on. So we have kind of rescheduled that. But I have other plans going on. I'm planning to go to Chesington. I've never been there before. I've been to Thorpe Park and Logoland before, but I'm planning to go there. I think it's good for me to focus on myself, hang out with friends, also focus on work, focus on my beauty business as well. This kind of coincides with this. But normally I don't really like talking about my relationship, my private life, like that to me is private. I normally don't talk about those things online especially on YouTube or on my blog. No one's life is perfect. And obviously I know it seems like I show only the best or the good parts of my life online. This YouTube channel isn't just to portray to you guys that I have this amazing, perfect life where I do go out and everything is running smoothly. This is also to help you guys, entertain you guys, you know, 
Uh, also be real, um, and I don't show that part of what's going on. What's going on behind closed doors online, like, you know, on YouTube. And just trying to focus on myself, focus on things that I can control. And I think when you realise that someone doesn't like you as much as you would have expected them to, then you kind of question your own self-worth and you feel like you are not good enough, even though you are. Um, and I am trying to remind myself that I am good enough and that there is nothing wrong with me. But when someone, when something doesn't go your way, you kind of question your self-worth and you think that you're, am I not good enough for this person? Why do they not like me? And I've gone through that behind closed doors. I've experienced those feelings. And that's why I'm trying to keep myself busy, especially this summer. And I've got things, I'm trying to, get things for myself to look forward to. For now, I'm just focusing on myself and trying to improve myself instead of jumping from one relationship into another just because I don't want to be alone and just because I want to settle. I just had to build my self-confidence up and not rely on someone else to do it for me and to make me feel good and make me feel wanted and loved. I'm not going to dwell on that too much and I'm still going to carry on the day and just take you guys along with me make some great content for you guys to watch and also enjoy myself hey guys i'm back so i just put some makeup on i got ready it did take quite long and because i had lashes on for the last five weeks i wasn't used to putting makeup and taking my time during the morning but i'm just gonna make myself a quick iced milk coffee feed orlando and maru the cat and dog before and then go i'm ready to take on the day this is more like a natural glowy daytime makeup look but yeah it does feel weird and not having lashes on like i look so different so if you want to see more of the vlog then keep on watching I literally just passed Royal Holloway University. But now I'm going to see the George Eliot Hall, the student accommodation. Currently I am in Egham and then I'll show you guys what the university is like.
Royal Holloway University and it is stunning. This is my second time visiting it. I still got to be more comfortable with talking in public. I'm gonna stay here for like one hour and show you guys some more. and then I'm gonna find somewhere nearby to get some drink or a snack. I didn't buy anything from Waterloo Station. Now I'm gonna go inside that building and show you what it looks like. So I just had a snack and a drink. I'm just sitting by university, but I just had a wander and explore. I looked at the other buildings, including the one that I'm going to study in. So if you guys didn't know, I'm gonna study business and management. I was originally going to do psychology. Luckily there are not that many people around me and I'm going to go inside for the second time. Hi guys, I just got back. Oh my god, I'm so tired. I've been walking a lot, so I just got back home. It's so hot outside. It was 31 degrees today. Explored the towns, went through some pubs and restaurants, went inside, got a feel of the surrounding areas. As a university, I do recommend Royal Holloway. And yeah, so I hope you have enjoyed this vlog. Give this a thumbs up if you do, and hit the subscribe button down below to stay tuned. Much love, and I'll see you on my next video.